Good morning and welcome back to Carmsden Farm. Uh, not Carmsden Farm. We are on the Old Stream Farm in 1950, October 1954. Not 1954, but 1950 day four in October. So we have got a couple of loads of sugar beet to take over to sell this morning and a field of barley to get up and drilled and rolled as well today. take a bit from this end as well. Oh, got to back up a touch more. We've got a bit there, a bit of road sugar beet there laying about. trailer loaded and then we need to get this field of barley in the ground that's got that trailer pull. Get this now collected up. The starting point for next time. jump aboard the A10, get over to sell the first load of sugar beet for today. Going to use this tractor for the drilling from now on. It's got a little bit more power than the old McCormick. of fields need <coughs> drilling with barley so get those done today. They are both cultivated ready to drill so hope to get them drilled and rolled today and then we can concentrate throughout November on getting the rest of this sugar beet up and into the yard. Tractor struggles a little on one hill and then we'll bomb along on the next one. Yeah, I've got a break in the F1 testing, so trying to get some recording done before that comes up. The final day of F1 testing before the World Championship starts next season. Uh, 
this is all working fine for us. Won't be too long getting to the sugar beet factory, probably half the video will be getting the sugar beet sold, half of it drilling barley and then the rolling off camera. See how quick it takes us to get filled one plate drilled we may set worker off drilling the next field and get the McCormick on the rolls <coughs> so you see a bit of all of it but we will see time will tell how far we get with all those Took the sugar beet into there, get some money. It's only like 300 quid we get each day, but there you see, 323 pounds. But it all adds up and helps keep the farm afloat. We will go up, get the next load. Sorted. Uh, doesn't really take that much longer to get there than it does to get back, although a little bit of it uh, on the hills you go that little bit faster at times. <coughs> get the road sign that's laid down there. Bounce the tractor about. No traffic lights ringing. Train seems to be on strike. And as you say, uphill on the way back. Just about one mile an hour on that one. This is a steep one. Couple three mile an hour on that one. Whereas when you've got a full load, that takes you back five or six miles an hour. So but happy the way the farm is running so far. We've got two fields of wheat in, we've got two fields to be drilled with barley, which will leave us a sugar wheat field and an oat field to do in the spring. Sugar wheat factory closes at the end of February, so we've got between now and the end of February to sell sugar beet let's get ourselves around here get the second load loaded up and over to the factory And next time you join us, we will get this.
That has got that done. So one more bucket full to top the trailer off. And then fill the bucket ready for the next day. No point taking what we're selling from the heap. Might as well take it from the field. Another four days after today to get sugar beet up. Anything that's not all but laid on the ground can be collected in December, but we can't lift anything in December because it will be rotted away in the ground. So, as long as we make sure by the end of November that we lift some for the next month we can still harvest a little bit that's that switch that off Get this over to the cell point for the second time today. And then we can get on with drilling the barley. do need to get hold of some grass fields and some sheep as we go forward but sheep won't come until next spring when we can cut the first cut of grass That field to our right now is one of the fields that needs drilling. It's still only a couple of mile an hour down on that hill. This hill the steeper of the two. Still only about three miles per hour down, the McCormick would have been really struggling and going back through down to probably bottom gear. Uh, this will keep us with our heads above water money wise. until tomorrow we'll get a little bit of drilling done on camera Today is of course the last day that we can get the barley drilled. So what we don't get drilled today will be held over for oats in the autumn. We are over to the sole point now to make our next 324 pounds. Our old boy sitting on his tractor here.
Yeah, get that emptied. And again, yeah, as expected, 324 pounds. We will head back to the farm, drop the trailer off, connect up to the seed drill and get this barley into the ground. Hopefully we can get it drilled and rolled before you join us again. Uh, next time you join us, of course, we will Keep you up to date with what we got drilled and rolled. Right, get this tractor back in the yard. We'll get a bit of drilling done. Probably ten minutes. No sign of a train coming. Not my most favourite map, this one, but I have to say it is. It's a brilliant map. Just that uh, it's the kind of map I never <coughs> get on with just because you drive on the wrong side of the road doesn't sit right with me. But the map itself, absolutely amazing job has been done to get the out to you. Uh, we will get round dump the trailer in the yard and get the drill on May well dump the trailer just round the corner. Yeah, dump the trailer there. That will do for it there. See how much. Seed we've got in, 56%. Uh, head round, get ourselves filled up. Seed trailer can stay where it is for now. And then the rolls there will trail through to the field in a bit. Uh, here we have the field that's going to be drilled with barley. Start at this side, work our way along. can get our souls lined up 
and down, and away we go once more. A weird shaped field this one but pretty straightforward to drill once you get going <coughs> yeah it does take speed up the drilling process using our little A10 close to finishing this side of it as we can We should be able to get this side of the field out. We've still got 60% of our seed left. is all working as well as can be expected at the moment as so I hopefully next time you join us we can start getting some sugar beet lifted and uh, got one more month in which to get the sugar beet out the ground before we have to plough the field going to be put in before too long we've got this short side of the field almost finished now the longer rows and the rest of this will be done with the headlands once we finish the field yeah this tractor so much better for doing the drilling
still got 34% of our seed left so we will get a little bit more done before we need to fill up should get this round done probably one more we will see once we get all this up to this end get our soles into position percent sure that we will but I don't think we're going to get back so we will get up here and stop it there go and fill up as we do head over to fill up that is where we're going to leave you for today hope you enjoyed our trip back in time to the 1950 October 4 1950 please give us a like give us a share drop us a comment if you are new to the channel and you'd like to see more of the work we do here please subscribe to the channel if you give that bell a ring it will tell you when our content is available until you join us next time thank you very much for watching enjoy the rest of your day goodbye for now